All right, so in this video, we're going to go over some footwork tips for addressing the pitching rubber, specifically for young pitchers here. Guys who um, are new to pitching, one of the things you'll see is guys don't really know where to stand in relation to the pitching rubber. So you see guys do all kinds of different things. Uh, they'll start off either way in front of the pitching rubber or they'll start off way behind the pitching rubber. And the idea here is you just want to give young pitchers some basic tips for how to just get started in a good position because how you start is going to have a big impact on how you finish and how you perform your pitching delivery. So rather than starting way in front and having to step way back and then try to find the pitching rubber or starting way behind the rubber having to step forward to then get loaded up, you know, then you have to like swing that, that lead leg back to get loaded up. Start off with your heels on the pitching rubber, get them with their toes off the pitching rubber, so half on, half off. And that just puts them in a nice kind of centered over the pitching rubber position, makes it much easier to, to step and get loaded up. Now what I'm showing here is something I would not recommend. Another mistake guys make is starting kind of flat footed with the toes pointed out, not an athletic position right here. So that's not a, this is not a great um, starting position here. They're, they're positioned in the right place on the pitching rubber of my feet here, but the toes pointed out is just not a good athletic position, makes it tough to really consistently get loaded up well. You see I'm kind of having to like find the, the pitching rubber with my, my uh, right foot there. So what I'd do instead is get those toes pointed forward, about shoulder width apart, so your feet are kind of centered under you. Okay, feet about shoulder width apart, toes pointed forward. And if you're a righty thrower, have more of your weight on your right foot because that first step is going to be with your left foot. Okay, so more of my weight's on my right foot, then it's just a small step to the side as I'm starting to turn. So my toe's going to kind of point in as I make that small step. And that just makes it easier to then pivot, get loaded up, and you can just practice this over and over until you get comfortable with it. Get yourself positioned well, weight on that throwing foot, small step, load up, and then just repeat it. And just have them practice this footwork until they get comfortable with it.